Well, the interview itself is unprecedented, but what he said is even more astounding. The head of Canada's Security and Intelligence Service has divulged some shocking information to CBC News, revealing details about foreign government espionage right here on Canadian soil involving Canadian politicians. Richard Fadden made it clear CSIS is now keeping an eye on those politicians. It all came out during the extraordinary access CSIS gave to our former senior correspondent, Brian Stewart. Canada's Security Intelligence Service rarely talks publicly. When it does, people listen. In an exclusive interview with CBC, the CSIS director, Richard Fadden, exposed foreign penetration right into Canadian politics. We're in fact a bit worried in a couple of uh, provinces that we have an indication that there's some uh, political, uh, political figures who have developed quite an attachment to foreign countries. Fadden's most startling revelation, cabinet ministers in two unnamed provinces are under control of foreign governments what are in espionage circles called agents of influence or secret supporters. So for that matter are several members of BC municipal governments. A number of countries take the view that if they can develop influence with people relatively early in their careers, they'll follow them through. Before you know it, a country is providing them with money, there's some sort of covert guidance. At least five countries are surreptitiously recruiting future political prospects in universities. China the most aggressively, but Middle East countries as well. It's not clear how much the government has been told, but leading intelligence experts today were startled by Fadden's timing on the eve of the G20 summit. It is possible CSIS feels compelled by a sense of profound national danger. But very important principles of the rule of law and governance may have been compromised. So in that sense, I think CSIS uh, may feel that it wants to let the public know, and indeed let those individuals and governments know, uh, that they're being scrutinized. It remains to be seen what government will do now to blunt a growing foreign influence it has yet to even acknowledge. This is pretty stunning stuff. Absolutely. The intelligence experts I talked today said they've never heard anything quite like this come out, and they're, they're, they're absolutely baffled to a certain extent, but think it must be because, again, CSIS is profoundly worried at the amount of infiltration there is in this country. All right. Brian will be back with his second night on CSIS a little later in the program, and then I'll ask Richard Fadden for more details about his candid remarks concerning foreign espionage in Canada.